Corey Bowen, I'm hanging fell. Cheers, buddy. Woo! Nora, 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 come. <laughs> Nora Cup, it's an award that's industry based. You get voted by your fellow riders and BMX industry people. For myself, I think it's the most rewarding achievement you can receive. So, Nora Cup is a very prestigious award to be given. The BMX industry itself is really small compared to other sports. So coming to a gathering like Nora Cup, it is like one big family reunion. I've been in every episode of Hanging Foul. Hey, I'm back. Throughout the night, the awards are getting handed out and Garrett was a permanent fixture up on stage there. He's just doing what he wants and he's setting a great example, I feel, for the next generation. Thanks to everyone that came out here and is taking it, supporting me and Garrett was that much of a permanent fixture on stage, they should have just put a bloody seat up there with his name on the back of it. Dennis Anderson, he's absolutely a machine when it comes to riding and doing his thing. He rides all disciplines and he's just setting a great example. And he's going to take BMX in a good direction. That's what it is. BMX. All of you out here, that's what we're doing. Let's keep doing this. BMX is all it is. He's just cruisy, he handles business, he's a guy you want to be around. So I'm psyched he's part of that new generation that's doing it right. Way to go, Dennis. Dennis, 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 Dennis. Hucker, you know, second year in a row for winning BMX Dirt. I've seen the kid around for years, man, and his riding was that loose in the beginning. And now he's just become a polished rider in all disciplines. So he's finally put it together and the rewards are showing. It's crazy, I never thought of doing years I'd ever get one of these, let alone two. Like, oh, thank you everybody. And how much sicker is Austin than Vegas for our Cup? <laughs>A lot of people ask me this. It's pretty biased towards Australia because it's a slang that we use quite a bit. Hanging foul. It can be used in many different situations. You can be like having a rough day, pull up at the end of the day with the boys and just chill, crack a few cans, you know, just hanging foul. You know, taking a look back 10 years or more from where it all started for me, it was just working construction in Australia with this dream to come to America and just have the chance to be a professional athlete and just ride BMX all day, every day. And for it to like just become that, that's something to be thankful for. Now, as I'm like 31 years old, I can look back at all these good times and memories and just enjoy it. I've been through stages where I've just all I've cared about is contest results and you're stressful and you're hurt and the expectations from sponsors and this and that. You know, you're trying to prove something, but now I'm absolutely enjoying it 100% and just hanging with mates. And I still love competing, no doubt about it, but I just feel like the risk reward factor for myself, I'm not gonna do anything that's gonna jeopardize the other half of my life. You gotta maintain somewhere in the middle there with a professional career, but also keeping yourself satisfied. At the end of the day, it's about living life and doing what you love and having fun while doing it. Now, I feel like I'm in the best place in my life ever, just enjoying BMX that much.